Hello everyone and welcome back to another game of StarCraft. Today in the bottom left hand side with the red probes, we've got Y, 2, Kid. The man bringing it back one each. And the top right hand side with the gold. I don't really like how it looks. Zerg drones. It's Naka. All right. Both of these players just slugging it out. It in a best of five where you're one all. I think this is going to be another macro game, right? That's my assumption. I feel like if you cheese, it's got to be game four. Game four is the cheese game in a best of five. And in a best of three, it's game two. There's your, um, there's your tips and tricks. This is a four player map, so 12 hatch it is. And drone scout following it up. Standard uh, 12 11, 12 hatch, 11 scout. One of my favorite builds to do. Probe coming up here. He's going to get the cross scout. And the main thing is that if your cross map, any sort of pressure build just kind of falls flat because of just how long it's going to take him to get there. Look at the boy go. He's running. He's running. This is the map with a neutral command center in the middle. It's one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. This was specifically added so that way if if you had a cheeky Zerg that wanted to be a bit cheeky, you know, could just come over here, damage it a little bit, drop a queen on it, and start making little nuclear bombs. So that was the intent with this. It doesn't really happen though, but you know, it's there. It's fun. Keeps the game neat and interesting. Oh, probe just gets right clicked down. Third hatch. Forge. Yeah, we only sacrifice one delt this time. I like that quite a bit. Cross maps, you know, you're not going to get a whole lot of damage done. Your first one got shut down pretty easily. At this point, you just don't even bother. Probes are saturating. It's beautiful. Oh, probe getting denied from going in. Oh, 
Scouting probe. Kind of getting bunched up here. Good work denying any sort of scouting getting in. So we are still on three hatches here. No layers or anything. Well, I say three. As if hatcheries four and five aren't coming up. Do you smell that? I smell me some hydras. Like, right? There's got to be. It feels like five hatch hydra. I'll be kind of disappointed if it isn't at this point. Yeah, there's the Evo chamber. Come on. Give it to me, baby. Here comes a big zealot push. There's the Hydra Den. We don't really have any Sim City here. We don't have a sunken either, so this is going to be tough. We five zealots versus five lings. Uh, I don't like that math no matter how you slice it. Oh, big drill. But it doesn't actually derp out any of the, uh, the um, zealots. So they just start getting free kills. And we've got to run. Go. Go, my boys. All right, we're feeling brave. These Hydras are falling. Zealots still have not fallen yet. All right, first Zealot falls, but we have gotten so much damage done. This suddenly just got a lot more desperate for Naka. All right, this five hatch Hydra bust became a four hatch Hydra bust very quickly. And just build just a couple Corsairs here. Not even going to bother moving him out. He's got all the info he needs right now. All right, we're going to try and send it. Hydra range almost done. Plus one attack coming. Storm about halfway done. We are getting an extra some extra Corsairs here. Interesting. I guess he did get some good success with them last game. But the Hydras are here. Oh, careful. Yep, immediately pulled a lot of the army back as soon as he sees the High Templar. Oh, bait's out of the storm. Zealot's just going to eat it. Just eat it. Oh, this is bold. All Y2 Kid has to do is hit the storm button. Oh, we are deep in the base, though, and we are not storming. None of these guys have energy. This guy's got energy. Hello? Finally. And we kill a couple of our own probes. What a hero of the people. Yeah, and um, believe it or not, all ends work for a reason. <laughs> like Getting a lot of damage done is great. The problem is when you do damage like that, you just have to survive. Current objective, survive. And it looks like, unfortunately, Y2 Kid here is not surviving. GG. And that's going to go ahead and put Naka up a point.